Hey, what's up guys? My name is Smeal and welcome to my channel. You know, I titled today's video, How to Handle the Fear of Rejection as an Entrepreneur. And if you're an entrepreneur, then you should know all about this whole being fearful of being rejected because that's one of the main things that us entrepreneurs always go through. You know, we always have this fear of being rejected by other people who are not interested in our business. Now, one of the things that I do on this channel is I teach people how to start and grow an online business. One of the main businesses that I'm in is network marketing. And so with network marketing, you know, this thing of being rejected is really, really huge. We go through a lot of numbers and we're presenting our business to a lot of people. So, you know, I decided a while ago to start to grow my network marketing business online. But prior to that, I was just like many other people, you know, presenting my business to people face to face and one of the things that I've noticed is that a lot of people unfortunately were not interested in my business so one of the things that I wanted to do is I wanted to reach out to more people and have more reach with my business and so I started to learn how to grow my business online and how to generate leads online for my network marketing business now network marketing is just one of the things that I can dabble into because I'm in the digital arena so affiliate marketing network marketing all of these different type of marketings that you can do online you know are really really you know beneficial to having an online business so that's one of the main ways that I promote my business is I promote it online with generating leads and putting out a lot of valuable content so I still have to talk to people so just by me you know building my business online doesn't mean that I don't have to communicate with people and one of the main reasons that people are fearful um, as an entrepreneur is that they're fearful of being rejected by people that they have to talk to and so you can't really get around this whole idea of you know talking to people every single day about your business whether you're in network marketing or you're in some different type of business that's you know not even online you still have to talk to people you have to network and you have to communicate with people and so the best way to handle that fear of rejection honestly it's a bit of a cliche but the best way to handle it is to honestly just face it head on there's no way around it you can't hide from fear if you go under the covers fear is there you know fear is going to be everywhere that you go and so you can't you know hide from it if you know that you have a fear of talking to people the thing that you need to do the most is try talking to more people you know if you know that you have that type of fear of being told you know no or having a rejection of being told no then you need to talk to more people and the more no's you go through the less likely you're gonna take it personal so you know the best way I feel for people to you know handle the fear of rejection as an entrepreneur is honestly to face it head on there's no way around it you're gonna eventually come to this point in your business where you're going to get some form of rejection whether it's people not interested in your product or your service or they're just not interested in the type of uh, business that you're in in general um, one of the things that I often encourage people to do to help you know build up their self-esteem and to help build you up on the emotional side is to start reading you know self-help books start listening to motivational audios and you know start listening to you know motivational videos there's a lot of you know motivational speakers out there that totally understand what it's like to be an entrepreneur and there's tons of them that you can find find online that you can listen to each and every day to help build your self-esteem up and to help encourage you to keep going whenever you feel like you want to stop or you want to quit your business so you know I definitely encourage listening to audios you know reading you know inspiring books start reading about people who are where you are start reading you know books and start listening to audios that will help you build your you know, self-esteem and to help build you up so that when you start facing a lot of these rejections in your business you're not going to get knocked down and it, or matter of fact if you get knocked down you're going to get back up and you're not going to fail on yourself or quit on your business so guys that is you know my best advice to you in terms of how to handle the fear of rejection it's honestly just to face it head on and the more rejection you go through the less likely you will even take it personal you will know that hey this is part of the game this is part of being an entrepreneur of course I face rejection is how I handle the rejection that's the most important 
important thing. And that's the way I think about my business. You know, I know that it's coming. I know that, you know, everyone's not going to be interested in what I have to offer, but I'm okay with that. But I know that there is somebody out there that is interested in my business. So if you are running your business online, you're not going to get around, you know, not talking to people because you're going to eventually have to present your business to someone if you're generating leads online. And now if you have a business that's offline that doesn't have very much to do with, you know, online marketing, it's still the same thing. It's still networking. So you can't get around that either. So I just encourage you as an entrepreneur to understand that this whole thing of being rejected, it comes with the game and you've got to have tough skin. You've got to have thick skin to be able to be an entrepreneur in today's, you know, generation. You've got to have that thick skin. So that's my encouragement for you today. Now, you know, I told you that I help people to start and grow an online business. So if that is something that you want to learn more about or you want to get more training on that, then definitely come back to my channel. Go ahead and subscribe to my channel because that's what I do on this channel. I'm going to be teaching you guys step by step how to start and grow an online business. And there is a certain way that I do it. I'm not just winging it. I have certain steps that I put into place for me to be able to, you know, generate more leads and to get more customers for my business. So if that's something that you want to learn more on how to do, then go ahead, like I said, and click that subscribe button down below so you do not miss out on any future episodes. And lastly, if you enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up. It really does help my channel. And if you have any questions on, you know, how you can start and grow an online business, or if you have any comments about this video, then go ahead and leave those comments down below. All right, guys. Well, I hope you got a lot of value out of this video and like I said come back and join me again for more videos just like this. Alright guys thanks for watching and I will see you on the next video.